Hello students. So in this video, we are going to cover question number 1.33 from NCRT of chapter 1. So here the question says calculate the number of atoms in each of the following and we have a set of questions given to us. So let's solve one by one. So here the first question is 52 moles of argon. So when you try to solve this, we need to understand one relation which is 1 mole is equal to 6.022 10 to the power 23 atoms because the question clearly says to calculate in terms of number of atoms your relationship should also be with respect to that and since you're finding for argon we need to know what is the atomic so here once you have done this let's write down that one mole of argon is equal to 0 6.022 10 to the power 23 atoms therefore 52 moles are given here so 52 moles of argon is equal to x atoms so x is what we are going to find out so just cross multiply x is equal to 6.022 10 to the power 23 into 52 so here 6.022 10 to the power 23 atoms into 52 moles divided by 1 mole so here mole and mole will get cancelled you just have to multiply this you will get 313.144 into 10 to the power 23 atoms now we need to look at its scientific notation so in this case we will shift our decimal by two placing so when we shift our decimal by two placing it's going to be 10 to the power 2 here so 3.13 into 10 to the power 2 because we shifted two decimal into this one 10 to the power 23 atoms just add up the values here so 3.13 into 10 to the power 23 plus 2 is 25 atoms so here we can tell that 52 moles of argon will contain 3.13 10 to the power 25 atoms so we can just write that one line that 52 moles of argon contains 3.13 into 10 to the power 25 atoms of argon so this is what you get when you solve it for the first one which is 52 moles of argon similarly let's see for the second one now the second question here is 52 units of helium that's our second question now remember one thing when we have a question in terms of atomic mass unit we will calculate it for atoms when is it it is in terms of grams we will cal calculate in terms of moles so here it is in terms of atomic in in terms of units so here we need to calculate in terms of atoms so here we have one atom of helium is equal to four atomic mass unit. This four is coming from the atomic mass of helium. Therefore, how many atoms of helium is required for 52 AMU? Just cross multiply it. So this will be 52 into 4 divided by 1. 52 into, sorry, 1. This will be 52 into 1 divided by 4. So here your x value is going to be 13 atoms. 
So therefore, we can say 52 AMU of helium contains 13 atoms. So it's an easy relation once you know how to calculate with what perspective. There's one last question to this. Let's calculate that also. So for the third question, we have 52 grams of helium. So here grams are asked. So here we will see that one mole of helium is equal to 4 grams which is basically the atomic mass of helium. So here we can say 4 grams of helium is equal to 6.02 to 10 to the power 23 atoms. Therefore, 52 grams of helium is equal to x atoms. We just have to cross multiply this. So, x is equal to 6.022 10 to the power 23 into 52 divided by 4. Now, when we try to solve this, this will be equal to 78.286 into 10 to the power 23 atoms. Similarly, when we try to shift by significant figures, we will get, so you are shifting by one decimal, so we will get 7.8286 into, we shift only one decimal, so 10 to the power 1 into 10 to the power 23 atoms. Just add up the powers, we will get 7.8286 into 10 to the power 23 plus 1, 24 atoms. So it's easy for us to calculate once you know the relation or the approach to any given question.